Greetings to another edition of The Random Chicken Files. I was planning on doing a different video this morning, but I decided to do this video instead. So, here we are. My starting point, uh, well, going for a bicycle ride this morning, and my starting point is Ligomery Spa. Here you've got the spa itself, a Greg's, fish and chip shop, a hair salon and a chemist. That building used to be located all over there but it was eventually knocked down, uh, replaced by houses and put in its current location instead. Uh, there's a proper story behind why all that happened but uh, that's going to be for another video. In the meantime, we're going to be cycling along the path in front of me, and yes, here we go. Nice little underpass there. Now, if you remember, this is an entrance to Apley Wood, a video of that I did yesterday. Uh, don't worry, we're not going to go through another tour of Apley Wood this morning. Instead, we're going to do something different. going to go along this path here. Now I know I've already done a video about this path but consider it well I want to improve upon that video make it better and here we are now.
Now, if you remember from yesterday's big video, here is an entrance to Apley Wood, and uh, when I was a kid, coming here with family, this is where the entrance we used quite often. And of course, nowadays, it's right by the hospital, which is over here. Now, uh, once upon a time, this little uh, walkthrough didn't exist. The uh, maternity unit at my Princess Royal Hospital here uh, is only a couple of years old. Uh, brand new, pretty good and swanky. And, yeah, in part of all of that refurbishment and redevelopment for a hospital. They put in this little walkway. And yeah. It's uh, really good for patients. Like I say, if you're a patient or visiting someone in a hospital and want to get out and about for a few hours, You've got a nature reserve right on your doorstep to visit. So, I definitely recommend visiting Apple Wood. Right, this here is the Southern Hospice uh, building. It's a local charity to Telford and offers medical care for those who need it. Uh, this building is actually uh, didn't always be here. Uh, I think it was built in 2001. Yeah. Something like that, 2001 I think it was built. Prior to that, it was just an empty field. But even though it was an empty field, it was put to good use. Uh, once upon a time, uh, during the 1990s, when I was at secondary school, every Sunday was a very large car boot sale happening here. Um, I think it was... A open something like in it was in the morning it was open uh but yeah me and my me and my siblings always loved coming here in the summer months on a sunday visiting the uh car boot sale and 
once or twice I purchased some really fascinating little books from there. But in the end, over time, the uh, car boot sale was to be no more, and they built this place instead. So yeah. As mentioned already, down there is the Apley Estate, what used to be the Apley Estate, Apley Castle, and it's now a series of private houses. Um, I've already spoken about that in my Apley Wood Part 1 video, which I put on YouTube yesterday, so feel free to watch out for more information. In the meantime, we're going this way. Tally Hope. Okay, that way uh, takes you past Wellington and back into Lee Gomery. This way is where we're going to go. Right, at the moment, we are now in Dot Hill. Um, which is another part of Telford. So let's have an explore this way. My one grandmother uh, used to live in Dot Hill here, but uh, when my mum, my siblings moved to Telford uh, back in, what was it, 1991 or 1992, um, my grandmother came here with us. And yeah, it's like really nice little quiet area. And uh, my grand, my grandmother used to live in those flats up there um, for a long time. And we'd often visit and everything like that. I liked it there. Uh, eventually she moved to a place to a place in a Ligomu across the road from where we lived at the time, but yeah.
Right, well, we're coming up to a junction at the moment, obviously. Right, over there is the Charlton School. Now, the Charlton School was not always on its current location. Instead, what used to be located here was the Blessed Robert Johnson Catholic College Secondary School. And I used to go to this school. Well, yeah, I used to go there. Um, so did my siblings, and also did my friends. Uh, or some of them anyway. Uh, but a few years ago, uh, quite recently actually, um, they decided to demolish the BRJ and relocate it to another part of Telford called Priors Lee. And the Charlton School was located in a different part of Dot Hill. It was actually it was located right behind us where we just come from in a way. And they decided to uh, move the Charlton School to its current location. So at the moment it's a brand new school and everything, so there we are. Okay, so to give you some directions, going that way, M54, Whitchurch, A442, this way, Dot Hill, Admiston. Same again, and it's our current location at the moment, so... Okay, um, I'm not going to go into Adm Admiston today uh, because I think that would be better being a different video but we are, what we are going to do is go into Dot Hill. We're not going to explore everywhere in Dot Hill. Uh, I think there's a section of it which, again, better off for another video but there we are. Now this road we're on at the moment, if you were to go straight all the way down, uh, you'll come out by the Morrison's supermarket, which is, when you get to that point, you're in Wellington, so. Hang about, just pause. Sorry about that detour, but a few weeks ago I was at a co-op shop in Shrewsbury and a mate of mine pointed out that there was a 35 centilitre bottle of whiskey, Isle of Jura, um, single malt, going for £9.50. Just... Uh, 
yeah, in, in another shop, uh, that same whiskey was selling for 20 quid. Just wondering if they had something similar going on here, but not in this shop. Anyway, back on the tour. Now all this is Dot Hill. Like we're not going to follow the road anymore because that's more houses and more part of it. It's all still part of that hill. Uh, but I reckon it'd be more interesting to go this way.
So just to say, what we've just seen and cycling through is, I think, part of Dot Hill Nature Reserve. So yeah, um, I only came by here once before a few years ago, but it's a really beautiful, nice place. Dot Hill Nature Reserve, so... Now, there's a lot more to Dot Hill Nature Reserve than what we just saw, but uh, I'm not going to spoil it all for you by filming it all. By all means, come and visit yourself, and uh, yeah, you'll soon see for yourself how beautiful it is. I think over here to my left. This is where, this is the location of where the Charlton School used to be before we moved it to where we saw it earlier. Uh, not sure what I'm going to do with this site, but uh, wouldn't be surprised if they build new houses. So as you can tell, we're back into Dot Hill. Okay, so that's where we came from and going that way is back to Apley, but instead we're going straight on.